Two Fish Talks. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Two Fish Talks. I'm Miss Brooke, and this is Russ. <laughs> and we're here to keep reading in our one year Bible today. Are you ready? Let's go. Jesus feeds 5,000 people Matthew 14, Mark 6, Luke 9, and John 6. Sometimes Jesus and his disciples got tired and had to get away from the crowds. One day they got into boats and sailed to the other side of the Sea of Galilee. Jesus and his disciples climbed the hills to be alone, but the crowds followed them along the shore and found them there. Soon thousands of people had gathered around Jesus. He felt sorry for them and healed many sick people. He also preached to the crowds. Late in the day the disciples came to Jesus. Tell these people to go to the nearby farms and villages and buy food, they suggested. Tell them to find a place to sleep tonight. Jesus said to his disciples, You feed them. Then he asked Philip, Where can we buy food for all of them? Philip answered, There's no way we could get enough money to buy food for everyone. Andrew, Simon Peter's brother, spoke up. One boy brought five barley loaves and two fish, he said. But what good will that do for so many people? Tell the people to sit down, Jesus said. Over 5,000 people were there. Jesus had them sit in groups of 50 or 100 on the grassy hillside. Jesus took the little boy's lunch and thanked God for it. He began to break the loaves and fish into pieces. The disciples helped Jesus give the food to the people. Everyone had more than enough to eat. Gather the leftovers, Jesus said. We must waste nothing. When the disciples gathered the leftovers, there were twelve full baskets. They had started with just one little lunch, so the people knew this was a miracle. This is certainly the prophet we have been expecting, they said. So they made plans to force Jesus to be king of Israel. When Jesus saw what they wanted to do, he left and went higher into the hills to be alone. Thanks so much for reading with us today in our one-year children's Bible. We'll be back again tomorrow to read more. Okay, Russ? <laughs> See you then. Bye-bye.